I'll caution to you, the real reflection of you. All right, so today, I had this mini situation. Uh, I don't even know if mini situation would be the proper word, because uh, I think every situation is a situation, but I'm, I don't know what a mini situation is, but it sounded like an interesting thing to say at the time. Um, anyways, while I was undergoing this mini situation... I was helping someone out with, with something. They were troubled about something. And I was just talking to them, you know, being, being counsel, if you will, for this individual. And what was really cool was in that moment, it reminded me of how much I am able to be of service, you know, and how important being of service is, especially when... There's been so many people who have been there before me in the past, before for me in the past, you know, guided me, have helped me out, have uh, just counseled me, you know. So it was really cool to be able to give back in that way, one. But then two, it's like all the things that I've learned, you just don't realize all the things that you learn until you need it in the moment that you need it, you know. All the different little, I don't know, the breathing exercises, maybe from yoga or... Um, understanding that uh, just different things, understanding the mind, you know, how it's like, yeah, your mind might say something, but that doesn't mean that's, uh, that's the truth of the matter, you know, or what have all these different things. It's, um, it's helped me a lot in the sense of being able to pass them along, you know, to, to others who have not been given those things yet, you know. So <coughs> that stood out to me today. <clears throat> and it made me really... Just consider uh, how important service is, you know? Service in the sense of, like, helping, I don't know, someone who needs help. Now, it could be, hey, I can't pay for my groceries this week. Can you help me out? But it could also be, hey, I just need someone to listen to me. Or I need, I've got, I need some advice or whatever, you know? There's many different ways to be of service. Or can you go slay this dragon for me, you know? I happen to slay, specialize in dragon slaying. Though, if I'm being honest, most of the time, I end up making a deal with the dragon because uh, the dragon's pretty cool to have on your side when you need him. So, <laughs> all to say that I, I just I really appreciated that. And then the other thing was like I realized how by being of service to someone else, I'm really helping myself out. It keeps me out of my own, whatever's going on in my life and, and helps me keep like, oh yeah, I'm not that different. Or oh, yeah, other people go through the same thing. <laughs> Which is really cool because I think that's part of being human. I think that's also part of understanding what, uh, what it means to be A good man, you know, someone who gives back to the world and and uh, return or pays the favor forward, you know. <laughs> so it was really, really cool. Um, and I was like, oh, this is definitely video worthy. The other reason why is because, well, maybe I haven't been doing a video for quite some time. And I'm sure some of you have been like, oh, my gosh, did he die? And it's like, no, I didn't die. I'm still alive. I do make videos from time to time. Maybe not always, but from time to time. <laughs> Though I will say my allergies have been, wow, rather, rather intense this particular allergy season. So I'm hoping that they're just about on the tail end of being over. But <clears throat> I also know that the second you say something like that is the second they flare up. So I'm not gonna get ahead of myself over here. Nonetheless, I think I'll leave it here for today. On that idea of service and what service really means and how when I am of service, I'm really helping myself out a lot. I'll leave you on this little picture. Look at that.